just look at the newly constructed resident for judges in Kumasi. Yes, this is what we say or we call visionary government. A government who have vision for all Ghanaians, all the institutions, knowing how vital and how and I say judges, the role they play in the society, to thinking about them and where they reside, and building this nice edifice where they will be comfortable to live. It's something that is a plus that we must commend this government. This government is doing a lot in spite of the hardship, in spite of the crisis. A government who have uh, not folded or a leader who has not thrown his hands in despair and trying as much as possible, always. So, Bema, uh, friends, in development, Abba, into their lives. This is such a leader that we must comment than always condemn. We have so many leaders. Uh, and you may be why vital, and you may be why unique. Uh, you have to provide for the citizen. That is why your friend leaders be visionary. And your leader, cosmetic, no a big jinaho, no kasaka sansim, and any ma niema, all in the name of politics. Trying to always confusing and deceiving the public. But we have a leader, and yama wo yin yano, uh, the legacy that he is leaving behind, you know, a hey, great such leader is what the country need in times like this leader in crisis no what i say on you say everything is in hey, a standstill but never hear you so i need leader if so in the ghana for a yabu train on binya a man and i do that go to father or pepper the man has a good will for the country ghana so we shouldn't allow some people who are just desperate and hungry for power a party called NDC, who has never helped the development of Ghana, or what they think about to say when they come to power. You say they are empowered just to loot, but the well being of those who made them a you know, they don't think about that. So, and, you know, we should continue support MPP and pray for the president. And also, we have to cooperate and coordinate with the president so that everything. Uh, the president and his team, I won. So in the MPP, there it's better to keep MPP in power for years. That is the only thing that will help Ghana development. That mistake we made in 2008, saying the MPP had power by now, even though we are in crisis, there are a lot of things up. And I ended that like we are moving to other things. MPP every day I see say omo nyo swa before, but in terms of governance, there. Ghana by Moody, who shall near my MPP. I am MPP has done really well, and it's a need to commend them because even when you go to Ghana, near my MPP, former president, Kufo, a bayer, the fuel, Nazamri, Nanado, a twasso, Konongo, a Asante Achim District Hospital, yeah, man Penina da Kufo, no leave foundation, everything. NDC came to power eight years, they couldn't finish it. MPP has finished and it has been commissioned. So that is why I say you keep MPP in power. And you know, Shanai's edifice are HMB. Just watch it.